My guest for today Orlando Johnson X NBA player and Ginebra and San Miguel Beermen import. How was your basketball career in high school at college? My basketball career in uh, high school and college, it was, um, I think it was pretty good. In uh, high school, I played a lot of different sports, football, uh, track, volleyball. Um, but yeah, once I got a little older, like to my senior year in high school, I kind of took, uh, I took basketball you know, pretty seriously and uh, wanted to give it everything I had. So, uh for myself, that like, I would say, like when I was like seventeen, I kind of like really took off as a basketball player because I spent a lot more time uh, just playing that. How's your experience playing in Indiana Pacers? Uh, I would say my experience playing with the Pacers was one that uh, really helped my career, helped me as a player. Um, you know, I would say more mentally uh, than anything, just because it. it I was around so many good players, and we played so well as a team. And our coach really emphasized, you know, putting the team first. You know, you don't really see that too much in pro sports, you know, where it's just like uh, we didn't really care who was the guy that, you know, got the credit. We just all played hard and played for one another. And that was, uh, you know, really, really big. So I think uh, my time in Indiana just helped me uh, become a better leader better uh, player and you know just to continue to grow in that aspect how's playing 10-day contract phoenix at pelicans um it was cool you know like it was cool to just get back in there um so be able to show you could play at a high level uh you know just have, have an opportunity anytime to put on nba jersey is special so you know, i was very thankful to you know to both both those organizations for giving me a, a a chance and uh, to you know continue to play and live on my dream and play at the highest level. What is your best memories in the NBA? I'd say just uh, you know um, probably my years with the Pacers, just how special that team was. Like you know the relationships I had with those guys, uh, and you know for us to stay so close and and build something, you know that was a. Uh, just a special group and you know I was um, you know get, getting out there and being able to play against the best players in the world night in night out you know um, that's what made you know being in the NBA so special it was like man I was you know regarded as one of the best players in the world at one, one point so that um, that's a special film so yeah. How's the experience playing the Barangay Hinebra? Uh, you know, playing for the uh, Hinebra was, was special. Um, that was my first time playing the PBA. Um, and, you know, so thankful for uh, my agent, Cheryl, at the time. Um, Cheryl Reyes for getting me over there and uh, getting a chance to, you know, put the, put the jersey on and, and go out there and compete and play at a high level. And, uh, yeah, I really enjoyed uh, the Philippines and, and loved being out there um, playing for, for you never. Why you choose Jersey 11 at 33? Well, I chose 11 because my uh, my birthday is March 11th. Uh, and then, uh, yeah, let's see. My I got 33 because... Um, uh, three uh, times 11 so my birthday is Mar March 11 so three times 11 that gives you 33 um, mom had me at 33 it's just a strong number like a lot of my favorite players kind of all rock 33 at some point like Shaq Bird, Kobe they all wore 33 at one point so it just felt real fitting and Scottie Pippen Grant Hill so a lot of the, the grades were 33, so I just felt like that was a number for me. Let's question your top five NBA players of all time. Five players of all time. Um, uh, LeBron, Jordan, Kobe, uh, Kareem, and I believe Magic. Magic or, Magic or Tim Duncan. Maybe right there. Yeah. So I'll probably lean with Magic. Thank you for watching.